Hi everyone, this is Adrian at 18 Echo SF and um, as most of you have probably seen before, those are my two um, commander length 1911s. Uh, the Kimber on the left is a stainless pro carry 2 and the one on the right is my Colt Combat Commander, the 1991 series. Um, the only reason I'm doing this little short video is to um, show you these uh, very cool grip screws that I just got. Um, they're from uh, the, the company 10-8 uh, Performance that's owned by Hilton Yam, the um, 1911 custom uh, pistol builder. And um, uh, the only reason I even decided to change these uh, grip screws, I'll show them to you in a second, um, I have... Um, uh, a set of VZ ETC grips on each of my pistols and um, when when I was at the uh, the last gun class that I took um, I lost one of the screws it uh, came out and I didn't realize that it was loose and it uh, somewhere was sitting on the course somewhere um, and I replaced it just with another screw but I had had custom screws from VZ in both uh, guns and I decided that I was um, going to look around for um, uh, regular slotted grips that would, um, uh, you know, I'd be able to use, you know, the casing from, from around to tighten um, uh, the grips without having to carry, you know, either uh, a screwdriver with me, you know, or an Allen head screw, um, uh, which is what the Kimber had on it. So I happened to find these uh, screws. I'll show you. They are really, really nice. Um, beautifully machined. I hope the camera picks it up well. Let's see if it can uh, focus a bit here. Um, and I'll show you. They are beautifully machined and um, slotted perfectly to uh, to fit, you know, a, like I said, a round casing. Um, and I decided to change them out on uh, both pistols, so let me just turn this over so you can see. And um, they really are beautiful. They're a little expensive. They were eleven ninety five a set, which I thought was you know fairly expensive. But you know at this stage in my life, what the hell? I figured I would just do it anyway. So um, let me set this pistol back down, and I'll show you the Colt. Uh, move this over here, and. Um, the cold as well. And um, matter of fact, let me see if I can focus on this a bit. Yeah, so you'll see they are really beautifully machined and they look fantastic um, on the gun. And now when I'm out uh, going to the uh, um, shooting courses that, you know, I'm taking. Hold on one second. There we go. My <laughs> there was a piece of... Uh, uh, paper towel inside that one when I wiped off the uh, the blue Loctite that I put on, but um, they are really really nice and um, you know so if you're looking for uh, you know a set of uh, grip screws because you've lost yours or want to change yours out for a similar reason, um, you know you ought to just check them out. Just go to uh, 10.8 Performance, check them out on on Google, and um, let me see my camera went a little funky there for a minute and uh, I think you'd be pleased as well so um, uh, this like I said this was just going to be a little four minute plus video just to show you grip screws which are nothing you know to to uh, make a big deal about but um, for me um, I, I I had like I said uh, a set of uh, custom screws from VZ on the Kimber and um, I had to use, you know, a uh, an Allen wrench on those, and um, and after losing the set of VZ slotted ones that I had, um, at least one of them on the on the Colt, I decided just to change both sets out. So uh, hope you enjoyed seeing them, and um, stay well and safe out there, folks.